it's Michael W here. It's MichaelW.com. I want to do a quick video today, and this will be on the PlayStation Move bundle for the PS3. And basically, I want to do a little sort of unboxing as well as give some initial impressions on it. Quick note, I am shooting this from my iPhone 4. I don't have a tripod or anything like that. So it will be some motion within this video as well. I'll try to keep that to a minimum, but I wanted to test the camera out. And the only way to test it out is to what? To test it out. So let's get into the video. This Move bundle, it does include, as you can see, the motion controller, which runs for 50 bucks, the PlayStation Eye camera, which goes for 40, and the Sports Champions, and I can't remember if that was 39 or 49, but if you were to get all these things separately, you would pay between 130 to 140. So you do save a significant amount of money. Now, once you were to have everything out of the box, what you will be left with is the Sports Champions game that has an archery title in there, has a disc golf, volleyball, um, sword fighting game that you can't see on the cover, as well as a couple other titles. As always, you have the, the game literature, instruction manual and everything, and there's actually a, a demo disc as well. This has several titles in it, such as the Tiger Woods Golf that supports the motion technology. So it has a lot of content for you to go and get yourself familiar with that motion technology. All of these game demos do have to be installed, not ran from the disc. Um, from what I've looked at so far, they take up between 600 megs to over a gig. So you will need some space to get these demos installed. You can, you know, obviously delete them as needed but you do have to get them installed first now the only other two things left in the package are the PlayStation Eye camera which most of us have already seen at some point it's pretty straightforward it's only two options in it really that blue circle and the red one the blue would be widescreen which you do always need to be using for the motion technology and the red which would just be standard on the back you have the USB cable which is built in and that's something that always needs to be plugged into the, the PS3 to use it, obviously, since it doesn't run off batteries or anything like that. Now, if you're one of the newer PS3 owners like myself, you only have two USB ports to begin with, so this will leave you left with one. The last piece of hardware would be the actual PS3 Move Motion Controller. And this one, it doesn't actually come with a USB cable, which is something I found rather strange, but if you have any of the DualShock controllers, you should have a, a cable laying around. So you can just charge it up with that, straight through the bottom. It did come already out of the box with somewhat of a charge, so I was able to use it for some time, get a feel for the games. Similar button layout to the DualShock. On uh, one side you have the select button, other you have the start, trigger in the back, and that's pretty much it as far as the packaging and everything is concerned getting back a little bit into the game alright if you've seen any of the demos such as the archery video from Sony what's the first thing you notice when they were using the playing the archery game the person that was doing the demo they had two motion controllers but this bundle only comes with one now none of the titles force you to use two motion controllers and before you start the game they actually ask you do you want to use one motion controller or do you want to use two so th that is totally optional to pick up that second one me um you know i have children and th they'll enjoy some of the titles or at least i think they will that that are that will be coming out soon so, you know, being that it will be more than one player, I went ahead and I picked up a second motion controller. And I have to tell you that it's a big difference using one motion controller in the game, like the archery, to using two. It gives you a more realistic feel. Now, I've actually never used a crossbow, but I mean, just as far as the motions and everything is concerned, and the gameplay, it does give a, a more realistic feel when you're using two. And other games like boxing, you know, those fighting games, I can't imagine how the gameplay would be with one motion controller. I mean, like, what are you going to be like a person with one hand tied behind your back or something? I don't really know how that will work. But at any rate, I did pick up the second one, and 
it's work, it's working out well. Now, my next question would be if you've seen any of the other game demos, such as SOCOM. That's actually the only other demo that I've seen. But the SOCOM, you've noticed that they've also had that navigation controller. And again, that's something that's not included in this bundle. Um, I did want to take full advantage of the, the games as they come out, so I picked up that navigation controller as well. And, you know, again, that, that's another th another 30 bucks there. So let's leave the package alone and let's say, you know, just, just getting started up, what the, the pricing would be like. So you have the eye camera, which goes for 40. You have each of these, which go for 50. So, I mean, you have 100 there. You have 40 for the eye camera. And then you have another, what is this one? This, this um, navigation controller, that was 30 bucks there. So you're already looking at 170 just to get started if you want to use all of the games to their full potential. So, I mean, that's, that's a significant cost you know, just to, to take use of some technology. I think the prices may drop in the future, but, you know, that's that's another topic. If you want to try the games out, or the technology, rather, you either purchase it or you won't. So, I mean, that's, that's another discussion. Um, I've pretty much went over everything that I've wanted to cover in this video. Only other things that, that, I, that I do want to discuss is, is, again, even when when you purchase these separately, they don't they don't come with any any kind of USB cables or anything like that. So just just keep in mind you you will need one to get this charged. And you know that that's that's a, another thing that you have to to think about as well. I guess they're, they're sort of trying to push you towards getting one of those ports or the, or those bases to charge your devices. Because if you think about it, let's say if you were playing a PS3. Okay, and you're using one of the, the motion games. You already have one port taken up by the the camera, and then you have one single port left where, where you can charge one of your devices, but what about any of the others? So, I mean, something to keep in mind. But overall, so far, um, I'm, happy, I'm happy with everything. Uh, they're, they're very, very comfortable. Compared to the Dual Shock, I have I have big hands, but compared to the Dual Shock, the fit is just about the same. So regardless of your hand size, if you can use the Dual Shock, then you'll be able to use this as well. Uh, I do look forward to the boxing game as well as some other titles to see how they work out. And like I said, this this was more an unboxing and initial impressions. I think I've covered what I wanted to. And as always, I hope you enjoyed the video and I gave you somewhat more knowledge than what the obviously stated on the website would be. Any questions or anything like that, as always, let me know. And, oh, actually, one last thing that I forgot to include. Being that I just picked up that PlayStation, well, this, this bundle today, and this was my first time using that PlayStation, I... If you have any kind of flat screen TV or anything like that, they do have this, that mount clip as well, which basically what it does is if you have any kind of plasma or flatter TV, it just attaches to the top. So that way, you know, the, the camera stays in place. So, I mean, I guess they, they have a billion different ways to get money out of you, but it is what it is. That's all I wanted to cover in this video. Later on, I'll do a more in-depth review of, of everything. Like I said, any questions or anything, let me know. And that's about it.